If you want to satisfy your sweet tooth with rich decadent chocolatey dessert that is good for you then look no further these flourless brownies will get a big green tick from all the diets even better these brownies are gluten free refined sugar free and made with nourishing sweet potato hello and welcome this is healthy delicious bites presenting you a healthy way for brownie let's see how to make sweet potato brownies To start, you will need to bake two medium sized sweet potatoes in oven until they are soft and gooey inside. Once they are cooked, remove the skin and mash them in a bowl, setting aside one cup worth for this recipe. Personally, I think baking makes sweet potato more flavorful. and delicious since boiling causes the potatoes to lose some of their flavors and nutrients in the water let's preheat the oven to 350 degree and line the pan with the parchment paper and set it aside this recipe is so simple that you can make it in one bowl no need to have extra gadgets or utensils If you are running short on time then you can just dump all the ingredient in food processor and give one pulse and you are done but today i'll be needing some extra muscle exercise so let's get the large mixing bowl let's add 1 cup of mashed sweet potatoes to this add 1 cup of fine oat flour and 1 cup of almond flour Now time to add a dark cocoa powder. We need half a cup. I know my cup size is not matching to what I'm saying. It's just because my little monster has stolen all my measuring cups. Now let's add salt to test. Let's get half cup of sugar. I'm using coconut sugar. If you don't have, you can also replace this with jaggery. To this, let's add half teaspoon of baking powder. Now it's time to add the butter. Let's make it more rich by adding 3 tablespoon of almond butter. And here's the tip. If you are not fond of the nut butter, then you can always add coconut oil or any vegetable oil. This recipe is really forgiving. You can add any ingredient in any order. It's time to add liquid to our brownie batter. You can add water, you can add orange juice or even the nut milk. I am adding a liquid gold which is the aqua power. To this, let's add 3 tablespoon of maple syrup for extra sweetness. Let's combine to form a brownie batter. Now if you think your batter is bit thick and you are having hard time to combine it, let's add dash of liquid either milk or aqua power again. Let's combine all ingredient and make a brownie batter. Brownie batter. So, let's add handful of chocolate chips. This will make your brownie extra gooey and really awesome. Let's get the prepared pan and pour the batter. Smooth out the top. We are almost ready to bake. But before that, Let's add few more chocolate chips to make it extra decadent. Bake the brownies for 20 to 30 minutes or until a knife inserted into the center comes out clean. Allow them to cool before we can start cutting them. Once it is cool, let's cut them into the square or your desired shape. Wait is over. Let's enjoy the fudgy goodness of this sweet potato brownies. Not only these are most ooey and gooey, satisfying brownies on the earth, 
they're actually quite good for you. I'm sure that you will enjoy these healthy delicious bites. If you do, please share your joy with us. Please check our other recipes too. And please, please, please subscribe to our channel, like, share and comment. Thank you for staying on Healthy Side. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, stay safe and happy.